Update 1 on Tropical Storm Fiona, which has formed in the Atlantic Ocean earlier today in the morning, um, local time, Central Standard Time. With winds of 55 miles per hour and a pressure of 1,007 millibars, my analysis, based off satellite imagery, there are tropical storm warnings in effect for this system. Um, currently located 16.3 degrees north, 54.8 degrees west as of 6 p.m. Central Standard Time, September 15th, 2022. And if we look at the forecast here, you can see the storm expected to go over the northern leeward islands um, and the British Islands also and possibly go and um, make landfall in Puerto Rico, delivering some significant or minor rainfall. We really won't be expecting much from this system, although s most models or some models are predicting it to be a Category 1 or 2 hurricane. It's currently 371 miles away from Limol, 470 miles away from St. Bar. Barthelemy, 678 miles away from Yaboka, and 478 miles away from Charlestown. And all those locations might get impacted. Most of, most of these locations are in the Leeward Islands, and Yaboka is in a southern town in Puerto Rico. There are tropical storm watches in effect, and let's look at the sea surface temperatures for Fiona. You can see the Leeward Islands over there, but the sea surface temperatures seem to be relatively warm for the system for it to intensify and become a hurricane, which is probably what it's um, going to do. Here is the infrared imagery. You really can't see any rotation or anything on um, infrared. And if you look at um if you look at visible imagery you can see a little um in the center there and that circulation if you um look in the center close enough you can see it but it's mostly like um clouds not orbiting the center. Here's the Atl Atlantic Ocean and Fred Y you can see maybe something um under the Cabo Verde Prey. Um the Cape Verde Islands, maybe that's some thunderstorm activity, possible invest. 13E is active, you can kind of see that, and 98E. And of course, you can see Fiona there with thunderstorms leaving the coast of Florida. Here's the intensity models right now, you can see. Um, this is in knots, by the way, the wind speed, you can see. Um, like some models aren't expecting it to reach hurricane status some models are even requesting for a major hurricane or predicting a major hurricane probably gonna be on the cat two or one side but um it's too early to say if it's going to be a major or not looking at the jtwc you can see over there um tropical storm moifa um, leaving the coast of Japan and entering, um, uh, leaving the coast of China and, um, entering, re-entering China, possibly going to Russia. And you have Typhoon Nabidol, you can see it's a pretty, pretty, um, big typhoon, though I don't think it has much intensity, probably, um, I haven't checked, um, for Nabidol yet. And you have Murbog also skirting off into the north, um, post-tropical currently. Hope you guys enjoyed this update. Comment, like, and subscribe if you want more. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.